Hello guys, welcome back to Aisha's Creative Hub. Today I'm back with another video. And guess what? I'm going to give an overview on an amazing computer coding website called Tinker. So here I have opened Tinker.com and now we are going to get started for free. I'm going to make a student account, but you can make anyone. Like if you're a teacher, you can make a teacher account or a parent, you can make a parent account. So my username is going to be Aisha's Creative Hub. And then a password. Next, I'm 11 and my first name is Aisha. And then parent is Shahid and then and I'm not a robot, obviously. And join Tinker. So here we go. And uh, I'm just going to make a beginner account because I haven't done that much coding yet. So I'm going to choose all of them. Storytelling, Barbie, Art and Animation, Minecraft, Game Design, AI and Robotics, and Multiplayer. Apply. Now it's giving me a week six challenge or uh, design a soundscape using Forge to create an interactive scene with sound effects, musical notes and more. Then setting up a nickname and then the projects which have been shared in the Tinker community. Then the projects featured and the remixes made. So that was it. And now we come on to the dashboard. So in the dashboard, first of all, you have some recommendations where you, you can see this Tinker Summer Code Jam and then a freshwater scene, uh, Candy Quest, Space Quest, new projects, Minecraft mods, then this uh, ecological pyramid, Barbie Petwet, and the Hot Wheels, Moon Mars, Puppy Adventure, Spin Draw, Monster High, and Responsible Consumption and Production, Dance with Friends, and a lot of them. You can even view more as per your demand or whatever you want to make. Next, you have courses like the Mod Starter Pack for Minecraft, the Mythicraft, Minecrafters, uh, the Glitch Manor, Barbie, you can be anything, Star Runner, Crash Course, Wet Coding. Uh, the Turing Tower, and there are a lot of names given to them. Then the recommended projects for storytelling, animation, user drawing, which we chose before when we chose the option of never coded. Uh, then we have multiplayers, uh, then the communities, and the top makers. So this is all you get on the dashboard. You can even create your projects over here. You have blog coding, Minecraft, robotics. Python, Java, HTML, and some quick tips. So, let's make a basic HTML project here. And uh, let's name it as Aisha's Creative Hub. And let's see what happens. Oh, it should be a capital one. And then I'm just changing it to H3. Over here is one to H3. And then I'm just going to take this text which I had written over here. And then just to control X. And then I'm going to close this one. And probably insert some bold or italic. So here we go with bold. And then we need to close bold as well. The B tag is the bold tag. I'm so sorry. And then over here, we are just going to paste our text. Oh. What's the mistake now? 
oops, I mistakenly tagged it in. And now you can see it has changed to Aisha's Creative Hub. And then we can just tweak this is my anchor page. So you see this just changed it. So now let's just save it. It's already saved. And uh, when we go back, we go to my projects. We have an untitled one. You can just publish it publicly as well. Uh, so I'm not going to publish it right now, but you guys can publish your work over here. The games and apps which you make using the blog coding, your Minecraft, your text coding like the Java or HTML and CSS or anything like that and your favorites as well. Then when you go on learn, you get to learn a lot of things over here because it has some courses like the mod starter back here, the mythy craft and if you go to the coding puzzles, you have the Candy Quest, Puppy Adventure, Monster High, all of those which came in the recommendations as well. Then the intro to coding and uh, Minecraft courses, multiplayer battles, the game design games, the robotics and IoT, and then the text coding. So you can do any one of them. You can do a lot of them and you can learn from this as well. So if you go on Minecraft, you will see a lot of things over here, like your projects for Minecraft, your courses, the tutorials, and the Java server. Uh, so basically why only Minecraft is over here is because uh, I feel that this website is widely used for Minecraft and blog coding. That is why we have a separate section for Minecraft. And by the way, it is very much fun. Then when you go on to the community, you see the pop uh, makers who make these text codings, Minecrafts, and here we go with the top makers. So you can see a lot of them who have a lot of likes and views in about millions or thousands. So then you have a sign out option from which you can sign out, but we are obviously not going to do that right now. And then comes your profile. So when you go over here, you can choose any of the character. I'm going to choose this cute little girl. Uh, and then probably change her eyes to this one. And then and then some cute sort of hair for her. Uh, these ones, yeah, that this one's good. Then let's come on to her hand. I think she's perfect with this, so let's save this. And you got it here. Then right now, I haven't gotten any views, any likes, any remixes, any projects, or any code lines. So I'm on level zero as well because I haven't played anything yet. And then it has given me the nickname of strict vegetable. So I'm just going to change this. I want to change this, so we will just change this as well. And uh, then you can see a lot of things over here as well, the visual coding, learn with the home courses, learn how to build games with game design tutorials, see how people are modding Minecraft in their community, see how, program, uh, how to program a drone under robotics, wow! The text coding, and then over here your favorites and your followers, so, I'm not followed by anyone yet, and I am not following anyone yet, because obviously I've just made my account right now. Then my awards, and then, by the way, if you complete any sort of uh, mission or things like that, uh, you even get awards. Like, uh, I have another account on which I've completed an R report, so I just got a certificate from that. Then the Minecraft Java server, and then you have your settings over here. So we will just, you can even edit your avatar or even join a class over here. Uh, so that must be made with a teacher a teacher's account, and then the code must be given, and then you must join the class. So you will get your projects over there and all that. 
So let's do a small puppy adventure, like probably first two to four levels. Alright, let's go. Meet Pixel the puppy. Pixel has enjoyed a nice day out with his family, but it looks like they forgot to put him in the car and are about to leave. Can you program Pixel to bark and alert them? I think these are very really basic ones because they're just taking us from the very basic to a very high level. So that's just on start we need to bark. I just bark when I just hit the start button, it just barks. And I earn 10 XP. Look! A shoe! Grab Pixel to run to the shoe to pick up the scent. Alright. So on start, it means. What if we put two on block here? A baseball cap! Program Pixel to run to the cap to pick up. Run, run. I need that. We have four dots in total, so we need to put up four. Yeah. Pixel is tired from all the running. Use run and So first of all, it's going to be run. Run, 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 run